What's poppin', man? Sir Michael Rocks, Banco, and you now in tune with Hustlers Corner TV, man. Y'all keep it locked. Yeah. I'm in the loop on the lot, tryna cop that mozzie. Same old hoes coming out they body. Sweat Subornal, like how you feeling? Mm -hmm. so, you right. you know, say, 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 Really, me just uh, really getting closer and closer to finding my own my own sound as a solo artist. You know, I'm just narrowing it down more and more, figuring out more of you know what makes me write the best, what makes me deliver the best, you know, lyrics and everything. And uh, it's just a, that, that's the first step. That was like that was my first. I, I look at that as my first like strong solo effort. You know what I mean? And, it's got the best response I had so far, most downloads and listens and yes. best feedback, man. Like, people that never really used to fuck with me, like, they started really, you know, hopping on board with the Lap of Lux, man. So I think it was a success. Okay, so you just dropped your visual for your track, Great, which is on the Lap of Lux mixtape. Yes. It features Casey Veggies and Mac Miller. How, how are you doing with them two as two artists that are on the West Coast, right? So how did you... You know, interact with them. How did you hook up with them in the first place? Man, uh, Mac and Casey, man, those actually two two good friends of mine. Like every rapper is not your friend. Mm -hmm. A lot of a lot of motherfuckers be phony and not really your friend. But those are two those two motherfuckers I honestly consider two of my friends, man. They two real real people. They two good, honest dudes, man. They two, they're younger. They're a little younger than me, but they're real good kids, man. Those are like two little good homies, man, and they really are making good progress, and I'm real proud of what they're doing right now. And they came to Chicago um, for one of Max, Mac Miller's tours, um, shit, maybe like a year ago, okay. and they came to Chicago. And uh, Mac was like, man, let's get in the studio, man, Casey, get me, let's go. Okay. We got in the lab, came out natural, man. Everything was easy. They was like, man, Let's make a track. I was like, cool. I came up with that hook, and it was it was history from then on, man. Like those are two good friends of mine. Shout out to Mac and Casey, man. They doing real good. I'm real proud of both of them. And the song is dope. The TV showing it a lot of love. The world showing it a lot of love, man. So we just, you know, we doing what we're supposed to. Okay. So you mentioned that you have a video coming out soon. Yeah. Can you tell us about that? Like, what's the process behind that? Like, how did you get that song together? drill music that we have coming out now like the Chief Chiefs and artists like that. What can you how can you describe your your music? Man, my music is really just some space space age, 2020, like just cool shit man. Like that's all I can describe it as man. Like you know I came from the cool kids. That was the group we came from. I'm all about cool shit man. Like I do me, I do my own music, I do my own style and personality. I don't want to be nobody else. I want to do me and be comfortable doing what I'm doing. Yeah. Okay, so since this is the Hustler Spotlight on the Hustler's Corner, can you give me your definition of a hustler? Man, I think that a hustler is anybody that will work towards their goals and not take no for an answer. Anybody that just wants to see success and won't take no other option, man. Like, there's no other, it's no other option. There's no failure. There is no failure. Like, if something don't work, try something else, man. I think that's what a hustler is. Somebody who sees that something ain't work for this side and they go try something on the other side. And keep trying and trying until you hit it, man. Like, you can't. 
you can't fail unless you quit. I know that's cliche, but like that's really how it is. You can't fail unless you give up. So okay. I think a hustler is anybody who just like is going for success and won't take no for an answer. What can we look for next from Sir Michael Rocks? What's next? Um, I got a mixtape coming out. Um, on Black Friday, day after Thanksgiving, um, okay. Lapa Lux 1.5. Okay. It's just a continuation to the last mixtape I dropped with um, a couple new tracks on there and uh, a couple unreleased joints, so it's like an EP kind of. Um, and then after that, I have the next full length project uh, coming at the beginning of the year, so around January ish, uh, I'll be dropping that and it'll be, you know, full length, full length new stuff. Um, I think the title of that, I want to call it, um, I want to call it Money, Love, and Other Drugs, mm. dot, dot, dot. Okay. <laughs> and um, I haven't really, I haven't really put my finger on it yet. I think that's what I want to call it, um, but I'm still trying to figure it out. But as far as right now, that's the title. Okay, dope. So Any... Early, early next year. Okay, awesome. Before we wrap it up, any shout outs that you'd like to give? Yeah, man. Uh, shout out. You know, uh, shout out to all my guys, TPC, uh, Trish J, Shorty K, Mike Dougie, um, One Off, ENT man, Fats, Cardo man, um, everybody we rocking with the team man, we making good moves, everything's going well, how we want it to right now. Uh, and I think that 2013 about to be a good year for us man. So. Okay, well this is your girl Kanika B, the boy Mikey Rocks, Sir Michael Rocks right here with me, and uh, we're out. Peace. What's up, bitch? Yeah. I'm in the loop on the lot trying to cop that mozzie. Same old coming out there, body.